Hi guys, it's your girl Nashley Lovely and I want to talk to you today about this product the Nature's Gate Organic Conditioner Lavender and Aloe. I want to talk to you about this product because I was reviewing the Curly Girl Handbook and they suggested that you use a botanical or plant-based conditioner for your hair and that the ingredients the first part, the first half of the ingredients should be, you know, natural botanical type ingredients and that it should be certified organic, which this is both. It has a lot of uh, plant extracts and it is certified organic. It's on the bottle. Uh, let me just give you the first few ingredients, water, lavender flower leaf stem extract cedar alcohol uh, this is berhentrimon something like that chloride aloe vera juice aloe vera leaf juice um, licorice root extract horsetail leaf stem um, and it just the list goes on and on and on with different oils and different uh, plant extracts and there's a lot of ingredients as you can see it's in this section right in here it's a lot of ingredients and a lot of it is most of it is natural uh, plant-based type ingredients so what did I feel about the product well let me give you my first impressions first if you smell the product the product smells botanical okay it's you can tell that this is a plant-based product the smell is very strong, at least to me, it's strong. Uh, and it, the smell does linger. So if you like that plant-based smell in your products, in your hair products, you will like this. If you're sensitive to smells, then this may bother you a little bit because this smell stays in your hair, okay? Even after you finish doing whatever you do to it, the smell stays. Um, as far as consistency of the product, um, I'll just pour a little out. It's kind of thick. It's kind of thick. Um, it's not too too loose, and so yeah. I mean, it's it's a it's a pretty good consistency. It's not watery. It's not you know too watered down, and it's not too thick. I personally like thick products, but you know this was just fine. Now, what I, I do use this as to co-wash with because I really don't need that much to co-wash since I'm only scrubbing my scalp, so I just put it on my fingertips. Uh, I tried to use this as a leave-in, but it didn't give me enough slip and it caused my detangling to be a nightmare. So I don't use this as, a de as, a, as, a, as my leave-in. I wish I could, I really do, because of the ingredients. But they do have other conditioners and they have some that are supposed to be more moisturizing and I'm feeling that because of my hair being tightly coiled, I need a little bit more to penetrate through all that going on in my head. So, um, because you know, it's like your hair is like, feels really, really thick and I guess to get it through and to, you know, get it to detangle, I need something that's gonna be able to penetrate through all of that. And this particular conditioner, it does it just a little bit not enough I needed to do more but I am impressed with the product line so I'm going to go and try another one of their conditioners that are more moisturized base so um, that's pretty much it I did want to tell you about the nature's gate and they have a website you can go in there and order online you may be able to find it in your local store as far as my hair I just did a uh, two flat twists going down the sides, pinned it in the back, and then I took a, a headband and just put it around the center of my hair behind my ear. And that's it. So I co-washed yesterday. So I hope you enjoy. My next update video will probably be in about another week or two. I'm, I'm gonna do week three through six with pictures. Um, of the wash and go so you can see how the curly girl month is coming along and I may do another video in between there you know whatever I feel like doing this is my channel <laughs> so anyway I will talk to you guys later and have a blessed and wonderful day bye